features of file management. Class 4 Computer By the end of this lesson, you will learn about Copy and move a file or folder from one location to another Rename a file or folder Delete a file or folder and, not tampering with unfamiliar files slash folders. File Explorer is used to manage your files and folders. Click the Start button. Click the File Explorer option. The File Explorer window will open, did you know? File Explorer was called, Windows Explorer in Windows 7, and earlier versions. Components of File Explorer Look at the components of File Explorer in above window. It primarily has three sections. Navigation pane Details pane And the preview pane. Navigation pane is on the left side of the window. The folders are arranged like a tree structure. File list pane is on the right side of the navigation pane, and gives the details of each file. Preview pane shows the view of the file selected. Details pane shows the details of the file. Now, let us discuss some components in detail. Ribbon. It has three main tabs. Home. Share. And View. It has commands placed in groups for easy access. It also has a hidden tab. Click the picture file photo. Observe a new yellow tab, picture tools will appear above manager tab. File menu. It has a few commands. You can use it to open new file, or folder, with the current folder or use commands for administrative reasons. Address bar. The address bar displays the path of the selected file, or folder at the top of the file explorer window. Click the arrow on the address bar, to select the folder from the available folders. Quick access. Quick access is by default the first section of the navigation pane. It is like a bookmark for file explorer. It contains a list of frequently and most recently accessed folders. Double click the folder to open it. You can see then see all the files stored in that folder. Search box. The search box is used to type in the name of the files or folders so as to search it in the current folder. Default folders. The default folders are Documents, which is used to store documents. Music, used to save music. Pictures, used to save pictures. And, videos, used to save videos. View buttons. The view button are on the right bottom of the window. They consist of two options that are used to view files, or change the display of the contents in the details pane. The list option gives the file names of the files, with their icons. And the other option gives the details using large options. The different options of view tab are, extra large icons, large icons, medium icons, and, small icons. A drive is a location, where the files and programs are saved. Searching a file In the Cortana search box next to the Start button, type to search for a file. The search results will appear above the search box. Copy and paste commands are available under Home tab. This commands will create an extra copy of the file, or folder, at a new place. To copy and paste a file or a folder, click the file or folder that you want to copy. On the Home tab, in the Clipboard group, click the Copy button. 
click the folder where you want the file or folder to be placed. On the Home tab, in the Clipboard group, click the Paste button. Cut and Paste commands are used to remove the file or folder from the current location and move it to new location. To cut and paste a file or folder, click the file or folder that you want to move. On the Home tab, in the Clipboard group, click the Cut button. Click the folder where you want the file or folder to be placed. Now click the Paste button. To rename a file or folder, click the file or folder that you want to rename. On the Home tab, in the Organize group, click the Rename button. The file or folder gets highlighted. Type in the new name and press the Enter key. When you do not want a file or folder, you delete it. The deleted file or folder goes into the recycle bin. To remove or delete unwanted file or folder, select the file or folder that is to be deleted. On the Home tab, in the Organize group, click the Delete button. Or press the Delete key from the keyboard. Or right-click the file and select Delete option. If you have a file or folder you use frequently, you can create a shortcut on the desktop. Shortcut button saves you from navigating to the folder each time you want to use it. It will have a small arrow in the lower left corner of the icon. To create a shortcut, right-click the desired folder. Then select Send to Desktop. Create shortcut. Damaging or tampering with files and folders, which might be someone else's data, is considered against the computer etiquette. Now, let us have a look on keyboard shortcuts useful for file management. Mm -hmm.